Hey there, welcome back. My name's Donald. I appreciate uh, your patience with me. Um, I know it's been a while since I put a video out, a couple days, six days maybe. Anyway, just wanted to apologize first and say that my life has had its challenges. <laughs> I'll just say that, both professionally uh, and personally. Um, it's been quite a past couple of weeks so um, I entitled this video as an important to list daily I will share my opinion about that here soon I also wanted to give an update on the past couple of weeks uh, of sales and uh, let you know what's going on here in the basement stick around this is Mars bargain basement thanks for sticking around so uh, I have a huge mess behind me so I'll go into that in just a moment uh, but before we begin, let's go ahead and start with the motivational poem for today's uh, video. It says, we must find the strength to navigate life's most distressing blows, knowing joys are always waiting in the shadow of their woes. <laughs> a, lot, a lot to say about this. Um, yeah. So anyone who knows me, um, knows that this definitely touches my heart so um anyway uh trying to continue here so the mess behind me is uh, uh part of a lot of gathering resources uh for listing uh the past couple of weeks i have went to yard sales, estate sales, and I acquired a ton of stuff, so much stuff. It's just unbelievable I've acquired. You've seen my videos of what I've gotten. Um, and that was just one load. I have so much more. Um, but before I talk about the, the subject at hand as far as listings is concerned, let's just go ahead and run through the sales. Um, it shouldn't take that long and by the time I'm finished I'm sure you'll you'll understand my my answer or my yeah my answer to the, the to the question so these are sales from the 27th of March until um, the 7th of April so uh, um, I have two sheets of paper and it's not that big of items so Anyway, let's just go ahead and begin, and then we can talk about it in, in a moment. So uh, the first item uh, that has sold uh, uh, was a lot of nine of the U.S. Army Korea uh, slides that I got from that slide deck that I purchased for $15. Um, and then that person also purchased another um, slide from the Korean War. Uh, for a total of thirty dollars uh, for uh, ten slides, I also uh, sold the Ninja forty ounce uh, five cup blender food processor. Uh, that sold for twenty seven dollars and ninety nine cents. Um, that was part of a uh, Ninja blender I bought in a state sale. I think I paid. $25 for the whole thing and I've already sold the base I've sold the blender part <laughs> multiple times uh, it's it's relisted again uh, and this uh, blender food processor is now sold so um, once I sell the blender I'll be done with it but uh, I've, I've made my money up for that one uh, so uh, next is a a Duex uh, portable monitor for a laptop. Uh, this was uh, purchased at the Benz, and I think I paid, I don't know, like dollar fifty, maybe two bucks for it. Um, it sold for uh, forty-five. Uh, next is a. Oh, and the thing about that is. I wasn't sure. My sister actually found this. She said, hey, look at this. I didn't know what it was. So I took a chance and purchased it. 
I just thought, I honestly thought it was a, a mirror. You had a camera and you turned it on and you got to, it was your mirror. Uh, but little did I know it was actually an LCD for a, a laptop, portable LCD to extend your laptop screen. Um, tested it, worked, surprised me. Um, it even surprised me more when someone paid $45 for it. So, um, and normally I would say at this point that, that this is part of the uh, 20 into a cruise, $20 into a cruise. Um, but unfortunately, I'm going to have to put that on hold based on things that are happening right now. Um, and I'll, I'll, I, will, I will get back to that. Um, I like to go on cruises twice a year. So there will definitely be an opportunity for, for that to happen again. Uh, anyway, continuing, um, I sold a Pings, Pings, <laughs> I sold a Ping baseball cap uh, for $6. I think I paid a couple of dollars for this at a estate sale. I think it was half price day, so maybe a couple bucks. Um, then I sold a, a Ray Dunn's, Paul's, a Ray Dunn Paws Off Cat Dog Treat tin that was color gray uh, this was acquired at the indoor state sale indoor state sale in, indoor yard sale uh, that I participated in I think I, I spent as much money acquiring items at that yard sale that I got from selling items it, it was a crazy day um, but the good thing is that uh, the items are selling and it's uh, it's it's good um, but then again, it goes back to the topic we're about ready to talk about, about listing. Uh, if, you, if you don't list, you can't sell. And well, well, we'll talk about that in a second. Um, here's another thing that I found at the bins. It's a uh, long range wireless router uh, by Securify. Uh, this sold for $9.99. Again, this would have been another 20 into a cruise, but again, you know, circumstances beyond my control um, aren't allowing that to happen. Um, so it's not saying that I won't go on a cruise. It's just saying that, you know, I can't spend as much time as I've been spending on eBay. I'm trying to get stuff out there. Um, but uh, I'm going to do my best to try to make it work. I really am. Um, but regardless, uh, let's move on to the next item. So it was a um, Stafford Executive uh, men's blue Oxford shirt. Uh, this sold for five ninety nine. Uh, these shirts, if they sell, it's pure profit. Um, I bought some items there at this estate sale. I think altogether I was in sixty dollars. I made that money up already, and so now everything else is pure profit. Um, so. With the shirt and a couple items, it's, it's again, it's just it's just money coming in to help me uh, pay for shipping for other items. <laughs> anyway, uh, next is the uh, Department Fifty Six Crinkles Merry Bulldog. Uh, this was a very interesting ornament. Uh, bought it at a state sale. Uh, got it for half price. I'm not exactly sure how much I paid for it. Maybe four or five bucks. Uh, sold it for fourteen ninety nine. Uh, it was it was cute it, it, it was I guess the word to use is adorable uh, so I'm glad it's sold and I'm glad someone's actually enjoying it and then last but not least we have the 1961 vintage Lego system I uh, sold that for uh, 20 oh, shoot <laughs> I sold it for $75 uh, this was also purchased at half price I think I paid $32 for it um, uh, but that was bought in an estate sale so I'll put the total at the bottom. I don't have the total uh, with me right now, but I know it's it's not a lot uh, for the date ranges that I covered. So I, that's two weeks, and the reason it's not a lot is because I haven't listed. I haven't listed for a while. It's been a couple of weeks. I started listing uh, probably about maybe six days ago. Um, I started listening heavily actually well heavily for me uh, meaning uh, five items a day and I don't know if it has something to do with the eBay algorithm 
or what it might have to do with, or if it might when you submit new items, it, it, it puts you ahead of others. I'm not sure how it works, but since I've started submitting uh, listings at least five a day for the past five days, four days, um, my sales have drastically increased. So I have sold more in the past couple of days than I sold in the past two weeks uh, where I wasn't listing. And I'll actually have that video coming out. So hopefully um, Sunday or Monday is when I'll do that. I'm not planning on, I say not planning, but I'm not planning on uh, doing any resourcing this weekend. Um, and you can see why. I have at least 300 records behind me. I have a ton of Playmobil items uh, that I just recently put out there. I'm still listing more. Uh, I have, <laughs> I hope I'm saying this right because I'm sure we, it's not squash mellows, it's squish mellows uh, that I'm trying to get out there. And I was informed that I was saying squash mellows instead of squish mellows, so I apologize. Um, I'm learning uh, these are things that that um I know I mean you want to talk about microprocessors or Intel chips or Nvidia cards I can do that all day you want to talk about plushies or knives that's that's not my deal um, I'm still learning uh, I have a great group of friends that who are helping me uh, get through this so uh, It'd be interesting. So in case I haven't answered my my, my question about uh, should you list daily, uh, the answer is yes. Yes, you should list daily. At least two to three items a day. Like I said, I'm trying to do five. Um, sometimes I can do 10 if I put my mind to it, but uh, time is something I don't have a lot of right now. Uh, and I'm trying to do everything I can to keep my reselling business moving along, generating income so I can go out and spend. I like to spend. <laughs> if you see my past videos, I love to spend. I don't like to list, but I like to spend. And so I'm, I'm learning. I think my next couple outings, um, it's going to be with what I know best, electronics. Again, it goes into quick flips. I don't like things sitting on my shelves i definitely don't like having a mess behind me um but the good thing is i'm trying to find something i can show um as far as electronics but the good things is i do have electronics so i had been cleaning playstations uh nintendo entertainment systems uh n64s I have several of those that, that are ready to sell. I have the, I have a few already out. I just uh, fixed a couple of Nintendos today, and uh, I'll have those video. Well, I'll have those online soon. And actually, I am going to create a video uh, since I do like doing electronic repair. I will create a video on how to repair uh, Nintendo 64 if you have the blinking red light. I know that's a common occurrence and. A lot of uh, not Nintendo 64, Nintendo Entertainment Center systems <clears throat> speaking. So I know in a lot of Nintendo Entertainment systems, you get the blinking red light. It's really easy to fix. Sometimes it's the cartridge, sometimes it's the pin set. I will, in my video that I'm going to put together, I think I'm just going to show you how to do both. It's real simple, real easy to do. And, uh, and yeah, so look forward to seeing that here in the next couple of days as well. Um, as always, uh, thank you for watching. I appreciate everything you do. appreciate you uh, subscribing and liking. Um, and keep doing what you're doing. Uh, you're loved. And I appreciate each and every one of you. Uh, have a wonderful uh, rest of your day. And we will talk again soon. Thanks.